Hi everyone, welcome to my class. In today's class, we want to look at how to find the value of x and y from this simultaneous linear and radical equation. So this is the radical equation and we have the one linear equation that is there. So we want to solve for the value of x and y. But before we proceed, please don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe. Please subscribe to this channel and turn on the notification bell so that you can be notified whenever I post new video. Solution. We have two given equations, which are, number one is square root of x plus root of y will be equal to what, 17. Let's call this equation 1. Then, we also have x minus y equal to 17. Let's call this equation 2. Then, what do we do? We know that from equation 2, From our equation 2, we know that x can also be expressed as root of s square. That is, this square we cancel this. We are going to get x. This is also the same thing as root of s square. So s can be expressed as this. Also, y is also the same thing as y root of y square so then from this if this square cancel this root you get your y back so from our expression we know this implies that our y is equal to what root of y square then let's substitute anywhere you see why just put this there this imply that from equation 2 this imply that we have x minus y equal to what 17 which can also be rewrite as root of l square minus what root of y square will be equal to what 17 then you can see this is different of two square that is this can also be expressed as square root of x minus square root of y all square so this is different of two square which is equal to what root of x minus what root of y into what root of x plus root of y so that is different of two square but we know here that we already know that root of x plus y from the given equation is equal to what 17 we already know this to be equal to 17 that is from our equation they said from equation one we say that root of x plus root of y is equal to 17 and here we have our root of x plus root of y this implies that our equation two can be rewrite as we have root of x minus what root of y into root of x minus plus root of y to be equal to 17. We already know this to be what? 17 also from the equation 1. This implies that we have root of x minus root of y into 17 equal to 17. Because we've substituted, we've substituted 17 into root of s plus root of y so according to equation one then let's divide both side by 17 is over 70 then over 70 this one will cancel this 70 here one so here is one this imply that we have root of x minus root of y be equal to what one let's call this equation three now this let's pick equation three and one now from equation one and three we have root of x plus root of y equal to 70 this is our equation one 
then equation three is root of x minus what root of y to be equal to one equation three let's add equation one and three together that is if we had equation one and three together this one will cancel this we are going to have two root of s if you got the word 70 plus 1 18 what do we do next we divide both side by 2 divide both side by 2 divide both side by 2 these two will cancel this this one 2 here 1 2 here 9 this implies that we have root of s if you got the word 9 s now we call to what 9 square that is if you square both sides so if you square both sides so the square will take away this square root and this one will be square so s is equal to 9 square therefore therefore our s is equal to what 81 now we've gotten the value of x so by adding equation 1 and 3 together then for y then let's subtract equation 1 from 3 in order to get the value of y, subtract equation 1 from 3. This one will cancel this again. Then we are going to have 2 root of y to be equal to 70 minus 1, 16. That is, we subtract equation 1 from 3. We are going to get this. Then let's divide both sides by 2. Divide both sides by 2. Divide both sides by 2. This one will cancel this. 2 here, 1. 2 here. 8. So, then this imply that we have root of y to be equal to what eight that if you square both sides square this square will cancel this this imply that y will be equal to what eight square then therefore y will be equal to what eight square is what 64 and now we've gotten the value of y and x our x therefore our s is equal to what 81 y our y is equal to 64 let's check to confirm if our answer is right or not let's check check from equation one we said root of x plus root of y is equal to what 17 this implies that we have anywhere you see x put it one day anywhere you see y put 64 there then we have root of what 81 plus root of what 64 score to what then this imply that root of 81 is what 9 then square root of what 64 is what plus 64 is 8 then 9 plus 8 is equal to 17 that satisfies the given equation then another one is listed from the second equation we have x minus y is equal to what 17 and our s is equal to 81 minus y is 64 so which is equal to 17 you can see that it also satisfies the given equation so therefore our final answer is s is equal to what 81 and y equal to 64 so please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe subscribe thank you don't forget to like the video comment on the video share the video and subscribe please subscribe thank you